Welcome back, everybody. It's me, Balut Function. How's everybody doing? Welcome back to Mission to Mars. Wavy, wavy. You're going to knock that block down, aren't you? So, if you remember from last time, we were moving our pump. So, I did state we were going to move it closer. So, I think the sensible place would be to put it in here. Well, not in here, but generally here. What we need to do is we need to put a block here. Oh, I'm going to sink and drown and stuff. We need to turn off the redstone engines. We have our lever. And we need to... Gather our things. Nothing left behind. And move the pump over to here. The reason I put this block here is because that's going to allow me place the pump directly over water because that's what you need to do if I didn't explain that before that's my bad I should have done but I didn't because I'm just my bad and there's a bad and bad and other things so so we can place this redstone engine directly on here by shift right clicking on here and that will give us that and a block here to put the lever on and we can start pumping that through and we can just that's it done basically we're sorted we need to take this down just now and not through. So I can now remove this block because the pump is over water. It's only there so I can, you know, literally get it where I need to get it. Weather's bad again. So I've got no control back there, but that's fine. Get rid of you, and we're going to move this piping down. The big problem we've got right now is I haven't thought this through. That's fine. Okay. Yeah. I've, I've, I've made a boob. Not one of the ones you want to touch either. Right, um, let's move across. No need making this difficult. And let's see if we can do the build from up. Okay, we might make this. Yes! So as you see, I didn't put a fluid transport pipe on here. That's my bad. I Just from force of habit, that's what I want. So we're getting okay. That's Yeah, that's fine. And this will pump the water down through to the system. And I need to dig around now. We can literally just actually block this in. We don't need access to that again until we dismantle it. But that's the pump move. We've got the fluid down. So this is basically the good start for getting our steam dynamo working uh, and getting our quarry sorted out. We need to check and see what that is. We don't want to stop the quarry early. So we want to... Now this is pretty cool. That's okay. I'm happy enough. And there's that's, there we go. Just as I was saying, here comes the water coming down now. So that's okay, so we're faster than gravity. It's because we're awesome. We're coming down, coming down. Diddly diddly diddly. And here we go, we've got this here. Okay, so that's step one. So we've got step two, so that's the dynamo. That will fill up with water shortly. Stick some coal in it. And it should, when it gets water, start to turn itself on, as far as I remember. Yep, there we go. And it's going to start storing energy. And that's all we needed to do. And that's pretty much our energy down here like that. We should be able to, as I said, use these leadstone energy conduits. Like this. It's a little problematic, but that's okay. I should really make myself a hammer. And we're going to stick the, the, the quarry here, I think. Let the quarry do its business out there nothing out there I'm concerned of just more stuff so let's have a look and see what the quarry's been up to and then we'll reset that up okay the quarry's done actually that's pretty good it's sorted so turn these off so we've got a little bit but it's the diamond that's probably more worth it than anything else so that's fine we're good to go so let's let that uh, destroy itself and we'll reset this up 
And remember, when you destroy the diamond pipe, guys, it's not going to remember what was on its filters. You'll need to reset that back up. We'll take the coal, because we'll need the coal for elsewhere. We've got two starting engines. We don't need them. As I said, this will start to dismantle itself. As soon as this quarry's gone, this will start dismantling itself out shortly. You'll just see it start to disappear, basically. So let's go and get this quarry set up over here. The first thing we're going to do, the quarry is to place the quarry. So, uh, bah. so two chunks it takes, and you'll see here. Got that. So we'll get rid of these here. Place one up here. That one's fine there. Play that one's okay. Uh, we can't place one here. Um, I'll place that there. Do you know that's going to get deleted? Place that there just now. Just so we've got a little bit of light, that's all. And we'll take... In fact, I don't like that. That's really nasty. That's just nasty, nasty, nasty. I should really go and get a hammer. Or that... Uh... Okay, right. So... This up. I think what we need to do is actually make a little bit more space up and around here. Lucky I find that. Well, and some more coal. I'll just try this because this is basically going to get deleted. We don't collect any of this when the quarry gets built. This literally will just get deleted. So it's better if I collect this now before the quarry goes in. Plus, I might actually give you a chance to see what the quarry does on setup. I've not described it, but. It's actually a lot easier to see it when you actually understand what it's doing when you see what it's doing. Rather than have uh, some guy just blab at you about it, it's just this simple. So, uh, da -da -da -da. so we'll put the energy on this side here. Yes, uh, there's another thing. Wooden transport tanks will take power, which means this will work quicker when it has power attached to it. But don't worry too much, we're not really massively concerned. And there we go, our quarry's going to get a lot more power. So you'll see it going up, jumping up, and now, here we go. So this is the red laser I was talking about. Okay, and you'll start to see it delete the blocks. So this is what it's doing now. And there it is, there's our little cube. You get to catch him, glimpse of him there, there he is, up there. So he is literally going around here now. Delete. That's why I removed that torch. Because it will delete the torch as well. So this is another reason why the steam dynamos is not... Um, it's not the most efficient way. The most efficient way was for me to bring power down from the reactor. But that's a long way. And a lot of... Uh, a lot of... A lot of pipes. And a lot of power. And we don't really need it. We've got this down here now, so we can literally just feed it with coal. So we need to get the outflow sorted out before this thing starts actually doing anything. So let me dig out this roof a bit more. Something I should have done ages ago and never have done. This is kind of forced my hand to do it, you lazy bum. Okay, and we'll just cover over this just now so nothing above us spawns, drops in and kills us when we're out and around. I uh, don't need these, but I do need this, I do need this, and I do need that. Okay, so same situation again. We're going to build this coming out here. Uh, I'm going to put the diamond transport pipe here, uh, just for clarity, and the void pipe. So on this, as I said, look, you see we've lost our filtering, but that's okay, we've still got stuff from here. So on the black, we want cobblestone. We're going to get the rest of the junk we don't want. Gravel. I nearly forgot gravel. 
cinnabar ore, we don't want that either. And entropy shard. Now this will be a particular entropy shard that it's going to do, but that's okay. So we don't want that. 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 And that will leave me... I'll still get some junk, but it means a lot. Like, you know, a lot of the junk won't come in. I wish I had some dirt down here with me. That would have just been so much easier. If I had some dirt along here, that would have been great. I don't have any here. Is there any flying around? Oh, yeah, look. There's a big chunk of dirt here. So I'll put that dirt in as the last filter so we don't get mud, because we're probably going to get a lot of dirt as well. Boom. So there we go. So basically, I don't want any of this nonsense. So any of you people doing magic on the server, I have limited resources now because the quarry is not going to dig that out. So there we go. As we can see, our little friend's digging along. It's safe enough for us to go up and have a look. Uh, let me just dig through here. This doesn't do any harm to us, but you'll just see him do his thing as he deletes the space for the frame so the quarry can start. And I'm going to try and beat him to this coal. So we've got some of it. And I'll start working on the coal in this outside area as well. You guys can't really see. He's going to get really upset if I put a torch here. He's going to come and delete it. It's fine. Put the torch here. Hit this out before he starts because he's going to start doing it in a minute. Gather the rest of this coal up. Pick up this bauxite ore. We're done. So our little friend's nearly started here. He's still deleting away now. Now, as I said, the more power that goes into here, the faster the quarry will work. And I, when I say it's fast, it's lightning quick. And um, we will get to that point because we will have the resources to build. Um, enough energy to actually sustain the quarry at a 64-64 um, which I might actually at that point do upstairs just for the, the neatness of getting power to it Okay, so our friend's really done. Let's have a look. He's nearly sorted out. He's just done the last set, deleting now. So this is much quicker than the mining guys. You'll, you'll have to agree. Doing this is way quicker than actually mining anything out. Um, right, get away from that laser. So here he goes. He's building. He's happy now. He's done. He's now assembling the frame. So imagine this going probably about seven or eight times faster. When this thing's at full tilt with full power, it, it is that quick. But as you'll see, we're going much quicker because the quarry has a more persistent energy. I won't have to go and keep checking it every couple of minutes. I can just come down, feed it some coal, and this thing will just go mental. So we should start to see... Uh, oh, hang on. I've done that wrong. I've done that wrong. It needs to go into red. Doofus, that would be everything getting destroyed other than that. That's not what I want. Quickly before he starts mining, we start losing stuff. Okay, I did that wrong. That needs to be red. Man, that was lucky I picked up on that. Okay, 
Okay, that's the major trouble players out. Oh, no, come here. Um, Cinnabar for a force thing. Cinnabar ones. Let me double check that because this is them now doing it. So everything's on there. It's now going. See what would have happened? We would have started collecting that. That's just a bad thing. Got Cinnabar ore in there. I don't have that force magic y style. Everything else I'm happy to deal with. At the moment, everything else I'm happy to deal with because there's just not enough of it to really cause any major issues. Oh! Essence dust. That's the thing we need to get rid of. Not we couldn't give a monkeys about essence dust. So we'll see the major trouble bloggers getting blown up, getting destroyed here. And then anything good will start coming down. So you'll see this is mining that little bit quicker. It's mining a little bit quicker purely because um, just the rate of power we've got in here is just a little bit better. Um, keep holding this piece of bread up. You guys go away. Okay. So you'll mine away quite happily now for a while. Is it one, two, three? It's a 9x9 nine nine block, the quarry, not an 8x8. Eight eight. I think it, res I think it, res it references it as two chunks. But what a chunk is on a 9, I have no idea, because that's a 4.5 and, and a 4.5, and but I don't know what that means, but never mind. So there we go, guys. Our quarry is set up again. We've got a new quarry going. We're now digging a hole down here, and we're working hard at getting this up and running. This will chew through coal relatively quickly. I do believe I've got some in the chest somewhere. I'm not sure. Let me just uh, move some of this garbage out of here. Because I'd like to destroy this chest or at least take it with me. Um, Anything else? Yeah. I'm going to take this with me. This, this, and this upstairs to the to the magic chest. The magic charity chest and see what goes on from there. I'm going to leave this running. Right, guys, this is a much shorter video uh, than the last two have been. Pretty much covered a lot of stuff. I hope you guys understood it. If you don't, guys, that's what the comments are for. Ask questions in the comments below. And uh, we'll see how we're getting here we get on and thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you did like and subscribe and i will catch you fellas and gals next time on mission to mars Later, everybody bye bye